What's up, you guys? Marty Schwartz here with MartyMusic.com. Uh, really appreciate you guys hanging out for a lesson. Going to break down this Traveling Wilburys classic. I love this song. Having fun on the 12-string, but it's the same as a normal guitar. Uh, also, Marty Music's my own project. And that first comment down there, you can go right there, sign my newsletter. There's free courses, help you play guitar. And I appreciate that extra support. Anyway, let's dig in. All right, this is really fun on a 12-string, but don't get scared. You can just see the strings are doubled. So it's just like playing a normal guitar. So we're going to take a D chord. And you don't even need to have your middle finger down because we're not going to be playing the high E for the kind of riff here. And your middle finger's free, so first you're going to hit this one. And I'm going to show you, you know, the picking, but let's get the chord shape. So we've got... So D, middle finger to the third fret of the A. That finger comes off, index goes to the second of the A. And then that middle finger is going to hit the third of the low E. So you got. One more time. Then we need to go O, two, three on the A string. So let's go back to that first chord. You, you, uh, any string you pick really in this sequence, it's not going to sound bad, but let's try and hit the open D and just go down the line. So D, G, B, and then back to that G. Watch my right hand here. I'm going to hit that third of the A and then just play the same picking pattern. And like I said, any of the notes here, that's fine. Any of them are good, but let's just go for that same exact pattern. A, G, B, G. So first we have, then this one. Then, index comes down to the second fret of the A, and you just pick the same thing. Now, if you're just a strummer, you can literally do that and still be able to play the song. So now, let's talk about the rest of the song. Nothing's really harder than that, but we, uh, we've got... Does, it repeats it. But as soon as you hit that, we're just going to go into this kind of C. Well, it's not a kind of. It's a C at nine. Second. I mean, I'm sorry. Third at the middle. Second. third on the B, third on the high E. 
and then index goes down to the second. Immediately followed by an E minor chord, and that index can already be where it needs to be. So, you know, it's a... Uh, So from the top. Now we need to go C, D, G, and then it starts over, so C, and me with care. So it does that one time, that whole sequence we did, but then the next time, uh, it doesn't go to uh, G the second time, it goes because the next section with Roy Orbison changes to the key of G, so it holds on D and then transitions to the next section with the G chord. So. <laughs> Sorry. So there's a few different options for this one. The easiest one, I think, as a guitar player, especially if you're a beginner, would be G. And then your index already is where it... Oh, no, I'm sorry. So G. And then a B7. So second, first, second, second high E. So... So the other option, instead of the B7, because the bass is still playing a G over that B7, uh, you know, it's really not complicated, but you could play a G chord with your ring, middle, and pinky, like this. And then you could just add your index finger to the first fret of the D string right there, like this. Or either one is fine. The next section is real easy. It's where Tom Petty comes in. Miss him. Uh, C. Every C chord needs a C chord to go to G chord. Then the C once again up to D. Stays on D, back to the top. That's the whole song. And I can't talk to you and play it at the same time. So let me go through the whole form now. Here we go. Step down to E minor, C, D, G, and then does it again. D. C, hold on D, because the next section is G, B7, C. Now the 
Tom Petty part C chord, every C chord, every C chord, to G chord, then the C chord, once again, but up to D, very clever. And then it just the whole cycle starts over again. guys thank you so much for hanging out i hope you had fun with the lesson classic song obviously also thanks for going down to marty music and checking out the uh free courses and all that stuff and that's it we'll see you later uh.